This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. Will Tiana Taylor and Ima Trumper have finalized their divorce? Uh, he will be paying $8,000 a month and giving her a few million dollars. Now, I saw someone on Facebook. It was a girl. It was a woman. She was like, well, she's the one who really has all the money. He doesn't have any money. He was an NBA player, okay? <laughs> and he had, at, the, at this moment, because NBA players... A lot of them blow through their money. He had about, he probably had about 10 to $15 million and she had a few million. She is not the most successful person that this woman was making art to be. She's successful, but she never got her just due with singing. She, she never really, you know, she had a few songs that took off, but not a lot. Um, when a song does 233 million, you're gonna feel it. You know, like you're gonna know it. And I, I believe this was botted, to be honest with you, because it didn't feel like 233 million. Not like us is at 330 million, and you feel it. You know, a lot of these artists, when they're on major labels, it gets botted because it, people are more likely to listen to a song with millions of views than a song with, you know, 50,000 views, you know? They they already look at it as if, oh, this is trash. You know, I'm not going to listen to it, you know? <clears throat> Anyways. Um, then we got Fredo Bang's meet and greet. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, and also a telltale that he had more money is that he has to give her money every month and had to give her millions of dollars, right? So, you know, they split their assets down the middle. There was no um, agreement before they got married or anything, and it is what it is, you know? But you know what? He shouldn't be bad about giving her anything. He has kids with her. He's a family. You know what I mean? It's different. <clears throat> 8000 a month is a lot, though. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. But... Maybe it's because, you know, they they probably have a huge mortgage. They probably have a big house. So the mortgage is probably... <sighs> mortgage is probably like six grand a month. That's probably just covering the bills on the house they had. Because it was big. You know, and a heating bill and a cooling bill in that house is like $1,000. Anyways. Fredo Bang's meet and greet. Yo. I didn't know Fredo Bang had fans like this. They're paying for the meet and greets, like just like Chris Brown. Okay, that's what's up. <laughs> Julio Fulio's girlfriend speaks out. She says, this is unreal. Just woke up, smiled, and tried to wrap my arm around my boyfriend and realize he's not even alive or next to me. Oh, that is sad. But he kind of like... <sighs> It's sad for... See, this is what it, what's sad about it. His choice has affected everybody else in his life. Because now he's not here anymore, you know? And, like, you know, maybe he didn't care about his life. But, like, he had people that cared about him, you know? So, it's, 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 it's sad. Cheryl Crow speaks about Drake using Tupac AI and says it's disrespectful. Da, da, da. Cheryl Crow, sh shut up and sit down, man. Go, go get your guitar out and go sing a song, okay? We, we, we don't want to hear from you. I guess Jeezy and JT are performing at some draft for the Hawks or something. Because all these billboards of... Uh, you know, like, why do they make it so inconspicuous that they had to pay blogs to post this and say... Uh, billboards of a snowman in a Cinderella shoe are showing up everywhere. It's like nobody even cared when they saw it. But now, okay, you're going to make us pay attention to it. Okay. okay. <laughs> this girl's going viral because she says these are the top cheater jobs of guys. Truck drivers, UPS, FedEx, barbers, military men, mechanics, the military, everyone cheats on each other. I know that for a fact. I've, I've, I've been hired by people that were in the military before, and they're always like a, in a triangular love love triangle. It's crazy. 
out-of-state workers, men with two-plus kids, men with a baby on the way, coaches, uh, plant oil field, what? Plant oil field workers? Construction workers, TWIC card holders, any man in a fraternity, club promoters, lawyers, business owners, <laughs> everybody. She just, CEOs, male nurses, ones that live with their mama over tw uh, 25 warehouse workers come on man she basically should have said all men <laughs> um <clears throat> then we got um one of Dolph's alleged killers was arrested for harassing and stalking warrants but now he's free again i mean he, how many chances this guy they're, they're letting him stay home everything like this guy they just give him everything but yet young thug can't come home and fight his trial from you know going commuting to uh court every day what is going on here this is crazy this is the, our court system is just super flawed man you know the judge must think this guy's uh, like cute no diddy you know because he wants he's giving him all the rope Flo Millie does a Tiny Desk concert. I get. I thought Tiny Desk concerts were like reserved for people like uh, you know, like people who have like a legendary catalog. But I guess they're opening up more to like you know, because Flo Millie, she's been around a while, but like she's got her break, I'd say, in the past couple of years. She's she's nice though. I like I like Flo Millie. Um. Then we got Julio Suli, Julio Fulio's mom. She says, R.I.P. son. Charles Jones II Fulio. Uh, the real life story documentary coming soon. The story that I can only tell because I know the truths um, from the fakes. I think I'm the only mother that keep it real why most others don't. Uh, while going on their own sons. Them not knowing I stayed on you about beef, cussed you out and begged you to take stuff down. Uh, you see, it's affecting a lot of people, man. It's very sad. I feel bad for that woman. Uh, then we got uh, WAC 100 appeared in court via Zoom to try to free Keefy D. Why is nobody even wondering why does WAC 100 want Keefy D free so bad? <laughs> why why this is a guy who killed the Tupac legend right or part of the, the plot come on <clears throat> then we got oh yeah Wack 100 does make a good point that Drake a big problem with Drake is when YG didn't take kindly YG didn't take kindly to Drake mentioning him in one of the diss records you know when he says uh yg really banged the set and then when they said uh so who said this they said uh it wasn't whack 100 it was somebody else they said c uh, when he said cb really bang set, cb really does bang blood and whack 100 certifies that he's 100 percent blood so they were like, oh, he's, that shows he's not really from the, knows what's going on here. No, no, no. It was a joke almost. Like, you know, Chris Brown is a blood. It was almost a joke. But saying he, even he bangs it more than uh, Kendrick. Because <laughs> Kendrick's confusing. It's like he's a gang member, but he's not. It's like, I don't know. Anyways, he can never perform that song saying YG his name in it ever again because YG has sided with Kendrick, obviously. Quando Rondo takes a plea deal. It makes me wonder, is he going to be... Is this, is this going to hurt the other co-defendants? Um, the Beat Boulevard posted, Quando Rondo reaches a plea deal in the drug case. Rapper facing 20 years in prison and found guilty. The Savannah-born rapper was originally arrested on June 16, 2023 for allegedly engaging in drug deals between October 2020 22 in 2023 now when you take a plea deal 
that can hurt other people's cases because it's admitting to um it's it's admitting that this existed and this happened you know and, and almost certifying that they have a case that's why the plea deals were so important in young thug case because it showed that YSL is really a gang. Now, Gunna says everything's the same with him and Young Thug. Uh, Young Thug's still getting paid from his music. They didn't change any contracts or anything. That's, that's real enough. I mean, that's <clears throat> that's paying for Brian Steele. And Gunna's since dropped two big albums. Ari uh, gets called out by Moneybag Yo. He says, watch out for the people in your life that look for a reason to fall out with you. Now, he's alluding... Ari was just at the Boosie uh, pool party, right? And she had her cheeks out and everything. I'm sure that caused a rift between these two. And Ari responds, you ain't really trying to play this game, is you? I'll finish in on this biatch. <laughs> I don't know. That's a... Uh, that's a weird relationship that I can't relate to. So it is what it is. Anyways, uh, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. I appreciate you all so much. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Let's see if I missed anything. I will check you guys in the next one. Let me see. Yeah, I think that's it. All right, guys. It's Jordan Tao with JT News. Smash that like button. Share the video. I appreciate you guys watching. I really appreciate it. You don't even know. I know you can go anywhere else. I appreciate you coming here to get your news. And I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.